Welders who ignore health work practices today are putting their long-term health in jeopardy. It turns out that those fumes inhaled through the years may cause serious medical implications. The noises that did not seem loud actually were potentially destroying your ability to hear. The parts that did not seem so heavy may trigger shoulder problems. Dr. Vincent Karuhanga confirms health risks associated with welding. Welding emits a lot of light and this light is likely to damage the eyes. Unfortunately, there and then a person will not know that the eyes are getting damaged until they are damaged beyond repair. Then the sound, that buzzing sound from uh, welding, uh, when one keeps uh, hearing that, especially uh, because the welders are close to what they are doing, that sound can also damage the ears. Now one of the worst problems is actually uh, the fumes which come from uh, the welding. Uh, these fumes uh, can affect the skin, uh, they can irritate the skin, they can irritate the nose, they can irritate the mouth, they can uh, also uh, irritate the lungs. And once they go into the lungs, it means also that uh, they have uh, arrived to many parts of the body, including the liver, uh, uh, including the kidneys. The world is full of 60-year-olds that regret not protecting their health just because they were ignorant of the effects. According to my findings, welders are aware of these health hazards and some of them have experienced some of the risks. Bruno Kasumba is one of the victims. He was injured by some of the machines, leaving him bedridden for four months. <laughs> <laughs> a one Frank equally shares his pain, who also explains other audios that they experience as well does. While doing their work, welders can be seen without various equipment like gloves, overalls and helmets to protect themselves. When I asked them why they do not have protective gears, they were quick to point out the high prices. Available data shows that long-term health problems associated with the profession are preventable. The good news is that you can reduce these risks significantly by forcing yourself to make a few simple changes to your daily routine. Dr. Karuhanga cautions welders to protect different parts of the body from various dangers. They may require to protect their eyes using um, um, the, the usual goggles. And many people do not wear uh, goggles at all to protect, to protect their eyes from light or protect their eyes from uh, debris from uh, what they are wearing and that is a great danger. Then they can wear um, overalls to protect themselves from uh, fumes and, and the metal pieces that may affect this, the skin. Then of course uh, what is true also uh, our people use uh, do not have uh, sound barriers uh, they may use uh, and uh, what happens they use cotton wood. Violet Namata, this is my story.